Hey everyone, this is Dylan, and today I'm going to be doing a movie review for you guys. So, this movie is Tusk. So, Tusk is from 2014, and it was directed by Kevin Smith, and also created by Kevin Smith. So, oh boy, where do I start with this movie? So, this movie is bizarre. I remember when this came out, it was my freshman year of college. I had just got to college, and me and my friend, I was like, hey, come watch this trailer for this movie. So I had her watch it, and she was like, we need to see this. So we actually went and saw Tusk the night it opened, and there was probably like five people in the theater, and I was just like, I thought that a lot more people would want to come see this, to be honest. But, uh, yeah, it, this is one of my, if you want to have a conversation starter, or if you just want to show your friends a bizarre, very fun movie to watch with people, this is definitely the movie to watch. So, I recently did this movie for a movie night, um... When I first started movie night it, with my group of people that I watch movies with, this was the very first one that uh, we chose, and I was, we were trying to find a place to do it, so we ended up watching this in the living room of my fraternity house, and so a lot more people experienced Tusk than actually expected to that night, so there was probably... That was probably the best showing that I had for movie night, because I have a group with like 15 people in it, but usually only um, five to seven people show up. But that movie, we probably had probably almost all 15, and then there were just some random uh, people that were in the fraternity house uh, that kind of got sucked into watching it while they were in the uh, kitchen slash living room area. And everyone was like, Dylan, why did you have me watch this? So basically what Tusk is, is you've got Justin Long and Haley Joel Osmond. So Justin Long plays Wally. And he goes, uh, he, they have a podcast. And the podcast is called The no -See Party. Uh, or the Not... It's called The not -See Party. So it's the N O T uh, S E E party, um, but it's Nazi party. So that's kind of like a pun. And so what happens is, it's like a podcast where I believe they like watch things, but then they you don't. Um, one of them watches it, and then they explain what happened in the other. So there's like this video or whatever of some. It's like some. Um, ninja guy and he has this like ninja sword and he like cuts his limbs off on accident so and the video went viral so Wally's like all right I'm gonna travel to Canada meet this guy and interview him so he goes and it turns out that the guy has committed suicide because of his injuries or whatever and so He's like, well, what am I going to do in Canada now? So he goes to a bar, and on the bar, they have, like, a bulletin board while he is um, in the bathroom. And he's standing at a urinal and is looking at the bulletin board, and there's a piece of paper, and it says that there's this guy, and he is seeking somebody to tell stories to about his time in the navy or whatever and he ended up um i don't remember if the boat sunk or he just got lost at sea or something but he got lost at sea and he got to this island and befriended a walrus so justin long is calls him up um and is like hey let's talk uh so he goes to this guy's house and they have tea, and they're talking, and Justin Long starts to feel really weird, and he realizes that uh, the tea has been drugged. So Justin Long 
wakes up and the guy, he's like, oh, I need to, uh, Justin Long's character is like, I need to call my girlfriend and tell her where I'm at and what has happened. And he's like in a wheelchair and um, his legs are covered. So he goes to like stand up. So he uncovers his legs and he realizes that one of his legs has been cut off at the knee. And he starts, he starts freaking out. And he's like, what What happened to my leg? And the guy was like, oh, you were bit by a spider and I couldn't get the doctor here and I am in a wheelchair myself so I can't go and get take you anywhere so I just had to cut your leg off. Understandably, Justin Long's character is like, what the hell is going on? And things just progressively get even weirder. So, the main premise, I guess, I don't think it's a really a big uh, secret, so I'm not going to put a spoiler warning on it, but uh, the guy is trying to make Justin Long's character into a walrus, essentially. So, that's basically the whole premise of the movie. And let me tell you that once you see the human walrus suit... My god. It is... Like, I'm getting chills just thinking about it. I remember watching it in theaters, and I literally... I was so shocked. Because it's nothing... Like, you have, like, this image of what it would look like in your mind. It's not anything what you would have even imagined. And I was just so shocked. And, like, when I, we watched this for a movie night... As soon as it got ready to show it, I like scanned everyone's faces because this is like one of those ones where <laughs> there is a reaction when you watch movies like this and it's usually hilarious. So I would 100% recommend that you guys check out Tusk. This is the first movie in Kevin Smith's, I think it, I forget what it's called. It's like the Northern Trilogy or something like that about Canadian movies. The second one is Yoga Hosiers, which I did watch that one as well. And it does have um, two of the characters from this because Johnny Depp's in this movie, but also his daughter is and also Kevin Smith's daughter is. And they're both the main characters in Yoga Hosiers. And then there's also a third movie, which I don't think has been made yet or maybe in the process of being made, but it's called Moose Jaws. So I definitely look forward to watching that one because I think that one's going to be more similar to this one. And one of my favorite lines, you don't want to die in Canada. And there was like this funny joke about um, the Canadian flag, that the Canadian flag is red and white and in the United States the flag is red, white, and blue. And the guy's like, in Canada our flag is red and white but never blue. Like, never, so nobody's ever sad in Canada. It's hilarious. But definitely check that movie out. If this seems like the kind of movie that you'd be into, I believe that it is streaming on Netflix. Also, Yoga Hosiers is streaming on Netflix, um, or at least the last time that I checked, because that's where I watched it. And then there was also somebody who was not able to watch this movie um, when I watched it for movie night, and they had just, um, they had watched part of it and then didn't finish it. So they went on Netflix and rewatched it as well. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think about Tusk. If you've seen it, do you like it? Or is it one that you would never watch again? And if there's any other movies that you think that I should review, definitely let me know in the comments down below. But thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Bye.